uh, sewer time. Also, if I remember rightly, spider time. Also, possibly super loud game time. I never can tell. Right. Use this. Go down here. We don't. Oh, I was meant to. Use it. That's the one. <laughs> I know what I'm doing. Definitely played this game a million times. I haven't forgotten everything. Honest. With Leon's face there. Very concerned. I wonder if this is like a. Like a North American version thing. Because I can't remember his face looking like that when I played it. I don't know. Maybe I'm just imagining things. Maybe it has been too long since I played it. Yeah, these things. Oh. Oh. Ah. I do know you're wrong. I don't mind spiders. But this is a big old no. Are you? There it goes. Oh, chunky, <laughs> chunky arachnids. Uh oh, stay back, stay back, stay back. Do 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 do. I think there's only two. Die just the stew. They're not as bad as the spiders in the first game, though, that spawn lots of little bloody horrible baby spiders after you kill them. I mean, they, those ones might do, but they probably all drowned. Oh, I'm, I'm a horrible person. I just killed all of their spawn. I believe this is a safe room. Ah, that familiar music. Sure, I'll take the blue herbs. Hopefully I won't need them. I sure I'll take the uh, the ribbons, but I won't need those either. Because, you know, the joy of save states. Like, uh, oh, yeah, that's true. I really shouldn't be. I'm doing the, yeah, I, I am. I'm doing the opposite of what I'm meant to be doing. Oof, jeez. Uh, oops. Yeah, shush, shush, don't tell. Don't tell anybody. I think I'm good to continue for now. <laughs> Already, it's like literally ten minutes done. God, this guy, him, this guy's horrendous. <laughs> now then, I believe I can't quite remember if something happens straight away here. If it does, I didn't bring my good weapon with me, but that's okay. Oh, that's right. I need the chess pieces that I collected. For some reason, I thought there was another one to collect, but maybe we've actually already got them all. And maybe I just forgot that we got them all. Or maybe not. Ada? I don't think I've introduced myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. Maybe she's like, well, uh, hi. It's a dead end. No, there's plenty of hole. You think we can get upstairs through this shaft? Through this what? Boost. I'll go and check. <laughs> Ada time Ada time This might be one of the other reasons I played Leon's route Rather than Claire's route Because when you play as Claire You have to play as Your alternate character is Shiri Who Bless her she can't She's got no weapons or nothing She just runs around being all Vulnerable And, and very killable 
Also, wait, how many, how much, how many, how many shooty bang bangs? 45, okay. Hello. This is all about timing. <laughs> yeah, she definitely is. Her bits are rough. Anxiety inducing. For sure. Let's just say there's lots of getting puked on. Which is the opposite of fun. Don't get me wrong though, I do like both routes and I do like the way the stories tie together and then when you do the B games, you have just the, he's what the other character saw when you were playing as this one. I, I, I like that, that's, I think that's clever. <laughs> Alright, so, not yet. Oh, this bit's especially nightmarish. Because it takes Chevy like 10 fucking years to climb back up, and I mean, I get it. She's only small, but still, even so. Alright, so, first things first. Let's move this um box down here. Love that these old games are still always going to have a little, a little piece of the internet to themselves like that. Well, you know, it's a fucking huge place, of course. Pretty much every old game is going to have a piece of the internet to itself, but uh, it's it's good to know though. I'm, I'll, I'll, I'll never feel like these games are going to fade into non-existence. At least I can always talk about Resident Evil games, but we go, oh yeah, I know those. I'm like, thank God. Yeah, I can go over there now. There we go, I'll get the last key. Should we check what the, should we just absolutely, should we save Leon the job of checking it and check it ourselves? Oh, look, it's a club key. Fabulous. Right, off we go. Let's go. Let's go hike this key back. Oh yeah, that's for sure. I've seen some super fun things. Like some Zelda things that are just absolutely like, oh cool, well that's one way of doing it, I guess. Hey, if you get the end credits, it counts. Oh yeah. I forgot. I couldn't remember what other items there was to pick up. Now I remember. She looks a big old bloody crate of bloody shotgun <laughs> shells through the hole. Water pipes under construction. Hmm. Like, I also found these. <laughs> Clong. <laughs> like hoping not to just like absolutely bloody leather him with them. Ah, oh, stop running into bars. Ah, just go. Oh, hey Sammy, how you doing? We're just about to watch Ada chuck some shotgun shells at Leon's face. I mean, Leon, hopefully. Can you hear me? Not his face. Anything but his face. Ada, did you find anything? Right here. Think fast. Here's one more. I'll tell you what, it was close. <laughs> Hey, I can't reach the ventilation hole. I'm going to have to find another way around. I'll catch up with you later. All right, but hang on. What? Ada, wait! That'll be a no, buddy. I think she's gone already. Nice. Double nice. I don't know how many shoddy shells I've got saved up now. I should probably have a quick check of that here in the save room. I always end up being way over I'm older by the time I get to at the end of any Resident Evil. That's not the save room. What am I doing? It's around the corner.
Ah, well, I mean, I haven't even really touched the remake. I played the demo of the th remake of the third one, and I'm like, yeah, I, I mean, it's okay. It's just, I don't know, I can't wrap my brain around these games looking any different than they already look. Alright, I haven't got tons of shells, but, you know, it's not a bad amount of shells. Now I need to remember... I think there's... Is, hmm, is there two? I think there's two doors for the club key. I think. Well, there's at least one. I think there's one further back in the police station. I hate this walkway. Why does this walkway even exist? Even when, even with no spiders in it, it's bad. Is this when they get out? I think they get out at some point. Is it this time or when I come back? That's when I come back. Oh, that, that club key opens more than I thought. One, two, three. I thought those were like two. <laughs> At least you're having it though. I mean, that's the main thing. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing pretty good. Having a pretty solid one. A, a bit of a non-stop one. It's one of those days where it's like I can't wait for the everything else to be done so I can sit here and do this. Beat a little bit of Classic Resident Evil gaming. Okay, I just need to pay attention to where I am again. Through here. Then all the way through the car parking lot. Oh, I think I remember the room that we're going into down here. I wonder if I should wait and do that one last. Maybe we should go up through the police station again and do the other two club doors first. Maybe. Oh! Oh! I forgot you were there! Uh oh! What? Ah. Ah. What? Maybe later. Ah, there's two here! Okay! Oh, shit! Okay, bye! Might have possibly forgotten about that happening. Perchance. <laughs> Just maybe. <sighs> I should have brought the shotgun. Oh yeah, that only lasts for so long. Well, long enough. Huh. <sighs> This was where the other one was, wasn't it? Through there. Round there. Back around that corridor. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, I think I need... Uh... Oh, beads of toast. Damn love beads of toast. Beads are so bloody expensive here. Beans off toast? Oh, you know, I mean, that's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a classic twist. <laughs> Beans adjacent to toast. Then there's another one. I like making a, uh, cheese and cheese and bean toasties. Oh, oh, just love that. I would, we need to get a bloody. We need to get a toasty, to, uh, toasty maker again. We need. We need one. Because you can't really make those in the pan, the classic grilled cheese style. You need the proper grilled cheese. Like machine thing, <laughs> toaster oven, to toast thing, you know what I mean. Oh, I like it to be a little bit, I like it soggy. But I, I mean, I'm a heathen, so I mean, there's no surprise there. That obviously, I, I like things that nobody else likes. Hello. 
I forgot there was another random roll of film sitting in here. Like the queen, the king, and the jack. Then the carriage will start running. Mm-hmm. Queen, king, jack. Gotcha. And... Is there any notes around here? Is there anything to read? Oh. Yay! Fade spray. Need our fade spray. I thought there was another report kicking around here somewhere. This is like the press briefing room thing. Oh, maybe I was imagining things. I could have sworn there was a report somewhere. Okay, well, maybe not then. Feels the light, huh? Yeah, I thought that was like a little report. No, never mind. Okay. So number 12. That's the queen. King and the Jack. Piece of cake. Let's go get that and then we can put that in the thing to do the thing. <laughs> it's like 99% of Resident Evil puzzles. You take the th you get the thing from the thing and you put it in the thing and it makes the thing go woo. And then you win. Also, my inventory is full. Hmm. I guess we should go and develop this film. And the good thing about going to develop it is that the place to develop it is a save room, which means we can also Grab the shotgun, because I feel like I should have that with me now. Since some uh, new friends have appeared. Boop -a -doop -doop -boop -a -doop -boop -boop. Uh, back through this way. Means we can cut out the scary corridors. Mostly. I like the way this room still has super creepy music in it. It's fine. We killed all the things. Um. I'm spooked now, because those liquors surprising me before have made me question what I remember about this game and where other secret enemies suddenly appear. Not secret. Rooms that you've cleared when new stuff appears. I'm like, I don't like that. Now I can't remember where else new stuff appears. It doesn't give me the best feeling. What do you mean? Don't need to use it right now. Okay, they're clearly the place. Damn right. Pictured in front of the uh, um, Aruka's tailor. Regressed into a zombie within two hours. Subject repeatedly complained about severe agitation of the epidermis in addition to feelings of nausea. This happened up to the moment he lost consciousness. Picture by Er Lambert. Er Lambert. Knickers. <laughs> Surprise knickers! Where? <laughs> Ah, right now I'm going to stash some stuff and get some more stuff out of here. I'm going to take... I might put one of the mixed herbs back. Keep the club key. Uh, oh, the first aid spray can also go in here. I'll take the shotgun. At least we've one space. But this item and this item will be used soon anyway. So that's no problemo. Just check here. Okay. I th 
think. Might be a little... Might need to do... Yeah. Might be a, a smidge of back and forth in here. But not too much. Boop, boop, boop. Gosh, and the B-side of the story when bloody uh, uh, t uh, trench court tyrant guy is chasing you everywhere and just appears in random places. That just adds a whole new level to it, though. And I love that extra level to it. The way he bursts through walls and stuff, and it's like, it, the game just totally blows you away. It's like, I wasn't expecting this to be able to happen. Destructible scenery? Like, as you're just doing other shit, it just absolutely blew my mind at the time. I was like, I couldn't believe... Like, you're just walking past a wall and he just comes barging through him. Like, what the fuck? Bonkers. Uh, where am I going? Uh, stop. Just run in a straight line. That would be the best thing to do. <sighs> okay. Do, 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 do. This door, I believe... Does this actually have the final chess piece in it? There's also a zombie in here. I always forget. I think there's a first aid in here. Ah, I'm not wasting my bloody slot on that. Nothing in this locker. Nothing in this locker. Oh, something in this locker. Nothing in this locker. Alright. Oh, Ah, his throat and abdomen have been torn out. Ooh, some party. The Watchman's Diary, here we go. August the 11th. I finally had the chance to see blue skies for the first time in ages, but it did little to lift my spirits. I was reprimanded by the chief for neglecting my duties while I was up on the clock tower. There's only one thing I still don't understand. What are these dead people doing walking around? Oh, that and the fact that the chief seemed to be more concerned about the fact that I was up on the tower rather than that I was neglecting my duties. Why was access to the tower prohibited in the first place anyway? September the 5th. Ah, yes. Typical diary entries. It's my kind of diary. One entry for one month and then a month later you go, Oh, shit, my diary. I should be using that, shouldn't I? So I haven't tried to keep one for the longest time. September the 5th. I recently talked to the old man who works in the scrapyard out back. His name is Thomas. He's a quiet man and really seems to enjoy chess. He even went so far as to design a special key and locking grid with chess pieces on them for one of the doors in the disposal yard. It's funny how that's... That was... That intricate lock system was made by just some random guy when the chief does all of his stupid intricate things with the art pieces in the police station. It's like, nobody does things normally in Raccoon City. Everybody does stuff fucking weird. We made plans to play chess tomorrow night. Can't help but wonder how good he is. One thing that's been bothering me about him is the way he's always scratching himself. Does he have some sort of skin disease or is he just rude? Rude. Why me? September the 9th. Thomas was a much better player than I'd imagined. I used to think of myself as a fairly decent player, but he did a pretty good job of humbling me. But the only thing I imagined that could match his skills in chess is his appetite. All the guy did was talk about food throughout the entire game. He sounded fairly healthy, but he didn't look quite right. Wonder if he's okay. My money is on that he was not okay. September the 12th. I was supposed to play another game of chess with Thomas, but we had to cancel it because he hasn't been feeling too well. You don't say. He stopped by to see me, but I told him to go back and rest since he literally looked like the walking dead. Ah. Ah. He insisted that he was just fine, but I could tell he was really having problems. 
Come to think of it, I haven't been feeling too good myself lately. Done. 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 Anyway, I think I'll take your gun, buddy. Thank you. I literally keep all of the magnum ammo for the last boss, and I think you only need, like, four? I can't remember. You don't need many shots with the magnum on easy mode to kill the last boss. For some reason, I keep, like, all of the magnum bullets that you find. <laughs> now, that'll do for me. I don't need to pick up the ink ribbons. We ain't using them anyway. There's no point. We'll mose you on. But I will need another... Um, I'll need to drop off some stuff because... Well, I'll the club key will go when I use that. Oh, yes. I remember where you used the cogwheel. Now, well, I think you need two, though. I think you put two together. Yeah, you need another cogwheel and you put them together. That's right. All right, well, you know what? Let's go and sort out these... Bastard liquors down here first. Wherever they're hiding this time. Hello. I just I, I just I, I I hate it. Ah Hello Oh, I missed. Well come on. Stop just... Are you really... Did you... Did you just... Did... Hmm. Are you actually coming this way? Or are you... What, what are you guys doing? Did you... But... What? Ah, oh! Fucking! What the... Oh, of course. Maybe just reload it quicker. Well, you guys suck. Okay, well, let's get rid of this key. The autopsy room is definitely one of the best places to be in a zombie game. Hands down. Totally... <laughs> totally safe. Maybe I should just keep my shotgun equipped. I can use... Uh, uh, oof. I, I used to be able to get out of here before they even all stood up properly. Or was it I could get out with just one... One munch. It's so fucking predictable, though. It's like, he cannot even pretend and, like, anything's, like, else is going to happen. It's like, yeah, you're going to get fucked over in this place, dude. Ah, that's fuck's sake. <laughs> How does that still get me? <laughs> when did all the fucking zombies learn to play dead? Oh shit, I didn't turn around fast enough. Fuck. Okay, but if you push him... Ah, two munches. Shit. Well, they might have got me. Oh, maybe they didn't. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit! Ho 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 ho! Zombie bites? What zombie bites? Didn't get me. Hell yes, I think this also has the bloody backpack expansion thing. 
You just stitch an extra couple of pockets onto it. At least I think that's what's in here. Machine gun and a side pack. And then whatever you take from this room though again in the side story, the other item is there. Ah, I do like that extra space though. Oh shoot, I've, I've got too many bullets again. I guess I'll have to use some regular handgun ammo. Wait, no, no, I don't. No, 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 there we go. Problem solved. Wait, was there anything else in here? I feel like there was somewhere. Even the hint, I should probably leave it for Claire. Ah, fuck it. It's fine. No, I don't want to take it. I thought there was something else, though, for some reason. I thought there was some... I thought there was some magnum shells in here somewhere, but evidently there isn't. But that's fine. I'm pretty... I'm pretty strapped already. It's fine. Now then. Maybe we do need to... Hmm. I thought there was like two pieces to that cog wheel. Or oh, am I imagining things? Let's go back up to the station. There was two. I'm sure there's two, because when you put one piece in, it turns, but it doesn't activate the mechanism, I think. Anyway, the last chess piece for the lock is behind the door that the cog wheel opens. What's the quickest way up there? I forget. If we go up those stairs there, there, and we need to be. Oh shoot! Really? That's that's quite a bit of that's a bit of a trek that. But I think it's right. Cells are there. Yeah, we have to go to the other side of the bloody police station. Ah oh, nuts! And if I go all the way to the other side of the police station, it turns out that I'm wrong about the thing. Hey, Mr. Goody, how you doing? How goes it? How's your How's your week? Hope good. If not good, hope gets better. All right, uh, man, still coming to, to still get to grips with the tank controls again, even though I played this game a bajillion times when I was younger. Maybe it's just the old reflex. Are uh, quite what they used to be. <sighs> okay, I think. Ah, fucking knew it. I was about to say, I think that there's liquors up here now. Ah, oh, okay. I ain't getting caught out again. I don't think so. Is there another one? Hmm. But Oh, there they are. But maybe I was just better when I was drunkled. That's a possibility. Your liquid courage just helped me just blitz through it without worrying too much. But now I'm overthinking it because I'm already drinking water right now. That might be what it is. 
And it's been just about long enough since I last played it that certain things are still give me a nice old scare when they happen because I forgot about them. Yeah. Oh, that, I mean, right? I apply it to pool a lot. Not that I play pool in like forever. Okay, so where's the co I think the other cog bit's up the top. One thing that's not true for though is darts. Definitely. Yeah, that's... <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, it's another game I was thinking of that had two cog wheels that fit together. Oh, well, that's cool. I'm glad. Nice angle there. Check out his arse. I mean, come on. What's the deal with that bloody angle? I know it was focused on the actual cog wheels, but Leon's positioning there. That's just the developers going, hmm, let's just, let's just show off. Let's just show off those angular, angular cheeks a little bit, shall we? And again. Yeah, why not? What's the worst that could happen? Jump down a big, huge, massive dark hole. Super safe. Blah. No. No. Get. Get away. No. Still don't like those squidgy, squidgy noises. Oh. Oh. Oh, shadow. Oh. Oh. oh, shivers. Oh, bad ones. Oh. Yep, definitely remember encountering that for the first time and being like, oh, shit, I don't want to fight that. Hey Ben, you dead? Ben. Can you still hear me? Come on, answer. Damn. I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <laughs> ben. Ben, as if we love the guy. Uh, we talked to him once. Bitter irony. The chief of police, a co-conspirator. Never would have guessed. Not in a million years. Not in a million billion years. Get that scum. Make him pay. Hang in there, Ben. Oh, oh my chest. It's burning. Guy, you were doing some antacids, maybe? What's wrong? Oh, um. Yeah, it might be a bit beyond medication at this point. Just, you know, possibly. God, what was that? She runs in, says, my God, what was that? And just like, you, 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 Ben? Just like, like, slightly, you know, horrendously mutilated body on the floor. No? I guess we'll just... We'll just read this then, shall we? While Ben's corpse just leaks viscera all over our shoes. Yeah, okay. We'll 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 do that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. To Mr. Brian Irons, chief of the Raccoon City Police Department, we've lost the mansion lab facility due to the actions of the renegade operative Albert Wesker. Fortunately, his interference will have no lasting effect upon our continued virus research. <laughs> uh, Oh, little do you know. Our only present concern is the presence of the remaining STARS members. Redfield, Valentine, Burton, Chambers and Vickers. If it comes to light that the STARS have any evidence as to the activities of our research, dispose of them in such a manner that it would appear to be purely... accidental. 
continue to monitor their progress and make certain their knowledge does not go public. Annette will continue to be your contact throughout this affair. William Birkin. To Mr. Brian Irons, Chief of the Raccoon City Police Department. I have deposited the amount of 10,000 US dollars to the account for your services this term as per our agreement. 10 grand doesn't even seem like that much now. It's like hell, you're going to have to lay down a lot more than that. The development of the G-Virus scheduled to replace the T-Virus is near completion. Once completed, I am certain that I will be appointed to be a member of the Executive Board for Umbrella Inc. It is imperative that we proceed with extreme caution. Redfield and the remaining STARS members are still attempting to uncover information on the project. Continue to monitor their activities and block all attempts to investigate the underground research facilities. William Birkin. At this point, Chief Irons is probably like, Fucking hell, another one? I told him to stop sending this through regular mail. Idiot. We have a problem. I have received information informing me that Umbrella HQ has sent spies to recover my research on the G-Virus. There are an unknown number of agents involved. They must not be allowed to take this project away from me as it represents my entire life's work. Search the city thoroughly for any suspicious persons. Detain any such individuals by whatever means deemed necessary and contact me immediately through Annette. With these precautions, any possible threat should be eliminated. I will not allow anyone to steal my work on the G-Virus. Not even Umbrella. William Birkin. Angry. Angry, angry man. Where are you going, Ada? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Yeah, but... Ada, wait! Hey! Do you read me, Claire? We now have access to the back of the parking lot. Got it. I'm getting out of here and heading to the sewer. Can you meet me there? I'm on my way. <laughs> I've always loved the way, the way Claire's uh, VA delivered that line. I'm on my way. It's like, jeez, all right, bloody hell, bossy boots. A miserable death. Wait, can't we go? I think we can go in here now, can we? Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, there's nothing even here, though. Shit, you would have thought they would have stashed something nice in there. Fine, whatever. Okay, then. Sewer time. I believe this would be when the dogs get out of the kennels, cages, finally. Uh. Oh. It must only be when you walk past them then, at a certain point. Which I feel like I already did. But that's okay. I think their kennels, uh, the cages only have like herbs or something. Yeah, Five, we could live without that. Sploosh, sploosh, sploosh. It's totally healthy to run through that stuff. It's absolutely fine. It's it's not horrible, or contaminated or anything. Uh, let's get the rest of it. Let's put the Magnum away. I ain't going to be using that willy-nilly, that's for sure. So that can go. Give me these. Put this back up further up. Perfect. I was like the way, of course. You have to put every single piece of the lock in. Bit by bit, rather than just like, here, I've got all four, just put them all in. I also like the way that these are already called Knight, Bishop, Rook, and King Plugs. Yet when we got the keys that were shaped like the bloody suits from a deck of cards, you have to check them. 
real closely before Leon tells you what they are, even though it's clearly obvious. <laughs> Save it again. Ah, uh, just but, but, yeah. I couldn't remember if the fight was before or after. Before is the answer. Hmm. Hi. If we just met and you already puked all over the place. Not very good etiquette, my friend. I need to. I don't want any of these little shits to jump on me. Oh, here he comes again. Okay, where, 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 where? Get the old uh, fun gun back out. I want to come into shot. I don't want to waste any of these bullets. Come on. Oh. Well, I only wasted. Oh, that little shit got on me, didn't it? Save yourself some health. Just leave and go back in again. There you go. It disappeared like magic. It just dissolved when I walked through the door. Oh, we didn't get to watch him dissolve into a hideous pile of horribleness. Sorry about that. I know that's always something to look forward to. One of the highlights of the game for me, if I'm being honest. Okay. There we are. Yay! Now we can go swimming into more sewage.